Hey guys, let's learn how to get ScreenFlow 7 for free. Hey guys, what's up? It's Jazz and today we're doing another video. A tutorial video on how to get ScreenFlow 7 for completely free. Let's get on with the video. ScreenFlow 7 is like $169 I think on the App Store, the Mac App Store. Uh, I think this works for Windows as well, so if you're on Windows, go try it out. I think it works. Maybe. I'm not sure, but maybe it works. I don't know. But it definitely works for Mac. And this is how to do it. The first thing you want to do is you want to go to this link right here. This will bring you to the Google Drive website, which you can download the file. Just like that, it will bring you to this page where it says download right here. Now what you want to do is you just want to click download. Simple as that. Guys, I will skip this part until I have downloaded the file. Okay, the file has downloaded. So what you want to do is you just want to, well, you can just go here and then click open like that. And it will say opening. I don't think it should take that long. Once it's, once it's been opened, it should look like this here. And then what you want to do is you just want to ignore open, ig, ignore what just happened there. You want to ignore this thing here. You just click manual install here and it'll come up with this DMG file. Just double click that. And the next thing should come up is this. You can just delete this here. Is this here. What you want to do, what you want to do is you just want to leave this here like that. And you want to go to your system preferences. Once you are on your system preferences, you want to go to security and privacy. When you have gone to security and privacy, you click general here if you're on anything else. And then what you want to do is you want to make sure this anywhere thing here is clip is ticked like that. If it's not ticked, you just want to click this lock here and enter your password and then you can uh, check it and then you can lock it again. Okay everyone, once you have cl uh, ticked anywhere, you want to go to terminal and you want to paste this into your terminal. Sudo, or whatever that says there, I'll leave it in the description below so you guys can copy and paste it. And then all you do is just hit enter like that. Since I've already done it, I'm not going to do it, but it does work and you won't be able to use the screen flow without it. So make sure you do that, don't miss that step. So when you've done that, you can just click out of system preferences and here you want to drag screen flow to your applications since I've already downloaded screen flow I'm not going to uh, add another one in just like that and then you well you would click it would do it automatically for you guys if you haven't done it before but for me it, I've already done it so I'm just gonna click stop and then you go into your applications and it should be in your applications like that and then you can open screen flow like this. This is my editing for this video that I've started already. So when you're in screen flow, you can do loads of things. You can do, um, you can file, export, you can publish to YouTube or any of these things that you want. You can export it. You can export your video as a MP4 file. You can add files and videos voices you can change you can make animations on your screen and then you can you can cut things out of videos and everything you want to edit your videos and it's completely free not 169 dollars because that's like so much for an editing software if you guys enjoyed this video hit that like button and subscribe that'll show me that you want to see more videos and i'll see you guys next time peace